don't look now, but former featherweight champion Jose Aldo is on a two-fight win streak. Can this guy actually reclaim that featherweight strap? Well, first of all, let's just acknowledge what I said last week, yes. right? Where I called this run. Yes, you did call I, it again. And granted, I'm not a better, so I don't put money on these right. fights. But I told you, you guys are sleeping on Aldo. Yeah. Aldo is someone that hits very hard, yeah. and he's been in every single fight he's ever been in, except for Holloway and uh, Conor McGregor, right? So, no surprises here. He did what he did, banged him oh, to the body, yeah, and got he him got out of there. It was a sick finish. I loved that fight entirely, man. How'd Listen, I'm going to dig my way out and keep saying no. He cannot get that featherweight strap. I think his time has passed. I think the featherweight division looks too good right now. I got guys like Volkanovski. Obviously, it's still blessed era, baby, mm -hmm. so he's not going anywhere. He even got Ortega there. And don't sleep on Ortega. He took a beating against Max, which means he can take a beating against Jose, but still keep that gas tank strong. Sorry, Jose. Great win, but you're not getting that And, Raj, just to finish it off, I mean, obviously, he can't beat Max Holloway. They fought twice. Holloway pieced him up every single time. Yes. I think it's fair to say that he can't get Holloway. Right. What he can do is get the belt once Holloway goes up to 155, which seems inevitable at this point. Right. Aldo's right here. He's still right here, man. That's what I'm trying to tell you so guys. So maybe I'll get that belt one day when everybody vacates the featherweight division too. I and we'll call it. me yeah. champion. I doubt it. I doubt it. I doubt it. <laughs> we're, I doubt it. We're out.